All right, so we had some pretty breaking news today, and nobody can seem to figure out if it's real or not. So first and foremost, the gameplay you're seeing is from an older season. As of recording this, I don't know what I'm going to use. Probably something from Chapter 1. So again, super early this morning, on Twitter, an image was circulating of what appeared to be the Season 3 Battle Pass screen. So this Battle Pass screen is just like you would see if you went to your Battle Pass right now in game. On the left, it said Battle Pass. Then it showed the customizable skin, plus the coming soon skin, and then the upcoming Fortnite crew pack skin. Like I said, though, everyone couldn't decipher whether or not this was real or fake. I've seen tons of people, including the data miners, say, well, hey, it looks pretty real. It's about a 90% chance of being authentic. So we're going to post it. We're going to share it. And then I've seen a bunch of people try to break it down and say, no, look at this. This is clearly Photoshopped. Or why is this like that? Or why is that right there? A bunch of things that kind of look like it's not real. So I am not going to be showing the image for two reasons. Number one, I don't want to spoil things for anybody. And as you saw from the thumbnail, I don't even show it there. I kind of blurt it out. Number two, if it tells you anything further, I want to avoid a copyright strike. I don't want anyone striking me for sharing this image on YouTube. So despite not me showing it, and I'm sure you can find it anywhere on the internet, just Google it or look on Twitter, I'm still going to talk about it. So what was displayed in the image, first and foremost, was Darth Vader and Indiana Jones. And if you're a fan of my channel, if you've watched my channel for the past month and a half, you'll know that we already knew this. We already knew that Indy was coming, that Darth Vader was coming. Unfortunately, Epic Games accidentally slipped up and put this in a live stream, and a bunch of people thought that was staged as well. That was not. They accidentally did that, so that was revealed. Nobody knew that it was Indiana Jones they were talking about. They thought it was Prisoner Jonesy. So I did a video on that just to clarify that it is Indiana Jones and it is Darth Vader. So we already knew that. We already knew they were coming. We already knew that Darth Vader was going to be in the Battle Pass and Indy was probably going to be the secret skin. And in my personal video, that's all I said. I didn't mention anything further about any other skins. Now, also displayed in the image next to Darth Vader was a female skin with an X on her chest. And a lot of people thought this was going to be a Nintendo exclusive skin. I guess it turns out that is not correct. And then for the customizable skin, it shows basically a skin holding an arm and you have to assemble this skin. So based on the image, I'm sure you can customize at least some parts of the skin, which sounds kind of cool. For the bonus rewards, we saw two other skins. I believe both of these were shown in a survey before, which made people further question the authenticity of this because they said, well, some of these were in a survey. Why would they be in the battle pass? But we've seen that before. In fact, I think an entire battle pass was leaked in one of the survey skins. And then for the Fortnite crew pass, it looked like an upgraded Mecha Team Leader skin. And of course, with Indiana Jones being the secret coming soon skin. So again, the main question here was, is this a real image? So as for the image itself, I'm not really sure that this is real. This could be fan made. But as for the skins, those are real. Those are 100% real, except for the guy with the black mask. I don't know if that's going to be in the battle pass, but all the other ones seem to be legit. Again, the image may not be real. I don't know. I've never seen that image before in my life. So someone could have just known what's going to be in the battle pass and made the image. But the skins are pretty legit. It's kind of unfortunate, though, that things like this get leaked. Yes, I've done some teasing before, but I don't straight up post images. That's awful. You shouldn't ever do that. Anytime I kind of tease or leak something, it's always just hints. Describing a leak is a lot different than actually showing it, in my opinion. So way back when in Chapter 2, Season 3, if you guys remember, someone reached out to me with pretty much the entire battle pass. And they said, hey, you want to do a video on this? It'll probably get some views. And I said, sure. And I had no idea if his information was authentic or not. But I looked at it and yeah, I could have said, well, we're getting this skin. We're getting that skin, 100%. But instead, I dumbed it down and I said, well, we're getting a skin that looks like a female Black Knight. And that was all I would say. Now, unless it's already given to us. For example, again, the Darth Vader and Indiana Jones... That was out there. I didn't say, hey, we're getting a Darth Vader and Indiana Jones skin. That was leaked first, and then I mentioned it. So I think straight up just revealing everything is in poor taste. If you're going to tease or leak something, don't just show the image. Just kind of, you know, build up the hype. You don't want to spoil everything. You just want to give a few teasers out. 
So I, for one, am pretty disappointed. If this turns out to be 100% real like I think it is, then it just pretty much ruined all the hype because, well, it's not the entire battle pass, obviously. But, and we already knew about Darth Vader and Indiana Jones anyway. But the other four skins are now revealed, if you saw the image. And then that fifth one, I don't think it's going to be in the battle pass, but, you know, always subject to change as well. So that's about all there is to it. I just wanted to talk about that huge leak that we got earlier this morning. Like I said, the image may or may not be real, but the skins are 100% real. Someone out there knew exactly what was in the battle pass and either designed this image themselves or really took a screenshot from somewhere, maybe a test server or something, and shared it with everybody. Now, as for my own teaser for season three, I know you guys are chomping at the bit. Let's just say the word tree. How about that? Regardless, season three is just around the corner, plus the live event. I, for one, can't wait. It should be a great season. Hopefully, you guys enjoy this video. Like is always appreciated. And don't forget to use my supporter creator code, which is TaborTime.